is tragedy across a part of America tonight. The terrible tornado disaster in the southern United States, the rising death toll, the towns flattened, the neighborhoods left in ruins. It is a fierce freak weather assault. 165 tornadoes in 24 hours. One of the tornadoes traveling 100 miles and so much death more than 190 in Alabama alone. And meteorologists say they have not seen this kind of destruction in 40 years. saying it was going right towards campus and then all of a sudden power went out and we lost the feed. Windows were kind of bowing in like they were going to shatter on us. First it was like real silent like you didn't hear anything and no sooner than we all got in the bathroom it like everything just got torn apart and the roof came off. I just know that was me going through it. I wouldn't know what to think. I wouldn't know how to react. You know, just Tornadoes or something else. I wouldn't know what to do. It hit a lot of places from Tuscaloosa to Birmingham to Anniston. And it was just, it was very frightening. Some families just aren't going back to their old neighborhood because there's nothing left. are hurt, you know, they lost their houses, you know, some people lost their, their family, some people lost friends, some people lost everything that they worked for their whole life. Most people be in houses for a long time, and uh, it's a lot of memories, you know, in a home. And when you lose that because of a storm, it's just something that happens, it's a part of life. And you, know, you gotta try to move forward, but, you know, it's tough when you lose everything that you have. This is more important to me than uh, any basketball game. Um, it's just changing people's lives. You know, basketball's lifespan is not as long as you know a human's lifespan. I try to touch as many people as I can just by just by being there. You know, I don't think money or anything like that would just make these people happy. You know, I think just going out there and spending time with them, you know, letting them know that, you know, they're not forgotten about, you know, that there's people who really care about their well-being. Today, we are uh, building some homes, you know, for a lot of the people who lost their homes in the storm. You know, I've invited a lot of my Twitter family to join me, you know, and I want more people to join in. And I'm, I'm happy that I have friends and family uh, who are going to be there to support me. We just landed in Alabama and it is smoking hot. Woo! Trying to get to work. We just arrived in Birmingham, Alabama. We're about to get on to a bus and head to a rebuilding site of about 10 homes that were affected by tornadoes on April 27th.
You can see from looking around here, we got a lot to do. We got a lot of folks that are giving their time today and every day out here. So we just welcome you to Birmingham. Thank, Thank you, you for being here and raising attention to this and helping us out. Thank you. destroyed uh, and they had to start over with a new foundation and rebuilding the house. 